Hello everyone from Sharon Farm here in Brimfield, Mass with our wonderful 600 silky chickens. You can't really see in the barn now because I'm looking the wrong way. But here to talk to you more about gardening this year. I watched a documentary recently about a new technique for gardening that use supplies we already have. Um, no water, no fertilizer, nothing besides your old pine shavings from your chickens or your ducks in straw. And building up a bed with it throughout the year. And with chickens, there's a note you want to stop at least three months before you want to harvest because of the chemicals in the chicken manure. Um, but the ducks you can use right away throughout the year. So we started to try this method, and so far we'll show you how it's worked out. And we also, I'll let you know, we started in July, two months later than we should have planted, way, way, way later. Our pumpkins we just only started a week ago, but I'm not too concerned, and you'll see why in a second. All right, now that I'm over here at our garden, we can take a look at what we're looking at. So if you look here, if you come to see the little tiny plants there, Kristen was not letting me flip my camera around right. So if you saw those, those were our pumpkins, very, very tiny. And then what we started 30 days ago, if you look at back and the other half of the garden where we did plant, then we have this, this massive, massive garden of huge things, which is amazing what has grown in such a short amount of time. And in just 30 days, what that gets you is a giant 13 inch long zucchini, well squash, sorry. We had zucchini just as good. This is long, but we ate that one. Half of it at least already, we've got more. So those are just the first we picked. Um, no water, no fertilizer, nothing. And in 30 days, we end up the crops like that. So this is definitely a method I'd suggest anyone can use. Um, we're up here in the Northeast where we get lots of rain this year. And it's also worked for that too. We've had too much rain actually. In fact, my white flowers all around the property and mostly drown in all the hanging baskets and other places from too much water. But yet the straw on the mulch seems to suck up the water enough, drain it away, but give it there for the plants when they need it. Um, everything has been doing phenomenal. 